So yesterday was one of the most frustrating days of beekeeping I've ever had, and today I'm gonna to try and solve the problem I could not solve yesterday. All right, so yesterday the Una hive here kicked my butt. Uh, I went in here, I opened them up, and there were swarm cells throughout the hive. There were probably seven or eight swarm cups, swarm cells. There were queen cups. A couple were capped, a couple were almost capped. It looked like they were getting ready to swarm. It was in a single deep box, and it was packed, like really packed. A lot of bees and just a lot of energy in the hive. Like, they just seemed like they were gearing up to leave. Queen cup in the, ooh, we got queen cups in here. Uh-oh. Whoa. There's a bunch of queen cups. What's going on, bees? So they're making queen cups. On that frame right there. They're not really in the position of uh, swarm cells. But this hive is super packed, so I don't know. There's something going on here. Swarm cells. Oop, there's a capped one. Yeah, uh, I think I just caught this. Okay, well, let's uh, let's find our queen and and split her out of here. She's got. She's probably on these one of these last three frames. I'm gonna put her into a resource hive right over there. Just give her a, just split this hive right up. So I decided the plan was to take the queen out of here and make a split. Take the queen and some frames of bees, put them into a resource hive, and the, that will do, be like an artificial swarm. Pretend the, sw the queen swarmed away, leave the swarm cells alone, and let them hatch out and just become a new queen. So I'm gonna do sort of an artificial swarm forced swarm, whatever you want to call it. Oh, there she is. Okay. She's right there. Right down at the bottom. All right, I'm going to put her into a nuke with a frame with no swarm cells on it. I'm going to put these into the little resource hive nuke. Okay, it's going in two, and you take the queen and put her over there into the other into the other box, and she is right there. So it took me a long time to find the queen because the hive was so packed and the bees were thick on the frames and it just was really hard finding her. But I finally found her, brought her over to the resource hive. It was all prepped and ready to go. Okay, this frame is loaded with queen cells, but I'm gonna leave that back in the original hive. I just wanna put the queen into here. So she's right here. I'm gonna put her in here. I tried to grab her off the frame, and I thought I had her and reached into the hive to put her in the hive, but I had missed her. Then I noticed her still on the frame. I chased her around the frame and she kind of scooted around. And when I flipped the frame over to see her on the other side, she was gone. Could not find her. Where'd she go? Wow, she's hard to spot. She just went over the other side of the frame. This is so weird. I had her and then I lost her. She's on this frame. Unless she, she jumped off the frame into the box. I'm gonna double check this because she, she may have jumped in here. in there. This is so weird. 
I just went through every frame over an hour here and uh, could not find her again. So I don't know where she went. Right now we just have everything originally that was in here. The frame she was on is right here. I'm gonna look at her again in a few minutes. And uh, there's two frames over there in the resource hive. That I don't know what's going on, but that was the most frustrating hour I've had in a long time. Okay, back to Una. This is our crazy critical hive. They are ready to swarm. I need to find Una and get her out of here. Probably about an hour and a half to two hours on this hive today. And I just want to get, I just want to find Una so she doesn't fly away. Anyway, I spent over two hours going through that frame, the frames in the resource hive, thinking she fell into the resource hive, thinking maybe if she flew away, went back to her hive, and went through these frames, could not find the queen. Two hours, ripping the hive apart, no queen anywhere. I put over two hours into this hive and I cannot find a queen. I know she's in here somewhere. I also know they're about ready to swarm because there's swarm cells everywhere and they're starting to get capped. So what I'm gonna do is try and spread them out. It's the end of the day, they're not gonna swarm today. So I'm gonna spread them out. I'm gonna put a deep on top of here and let them come up. Maybe take over a few frames give them a lot more space so they spread out on the frames. It'll be easier to inspect and the queen will be easier to find because they're like three thick on every frame. And uh, I just, I cannot see her. I can't see anything in there. So what I did after all that frustration was put another deep box, an empty box on top of this hive. I kind of checkerboarded them through two deep boxes in hopes that they would sort of spread themselves out, thin themselves out on the frames so that I could come here this morning open them up and look through the frames a little easier. There'd be more frames, but they'd be fewer bees per frame. And try and find the queen that way. Get her out of this box and get her into a resource hive so they don't swarm. So that's what we're doing right now. All right, so I didn't solve the problem Although, maybe I did inadvertently solve the problem because I think I may have lost the queen yesterday. Now, looking back at the footage, there is a chance, a very slim chance, but a chance, that a bee fell off the frame as I was flipping the frame over. I tried to grab her off the frame, and I thought I had her, and reached into the hive to put her in the hive, but I had missed her. Then I noticed her still on the frame. I chased her around the frame and she kind of scooted around. And when I flipped the frame over to see her on the other side, she was gone, could not find her. And you can see here a bee leaving the frame and going toward the ground. I don't know if that was the queen. There's a chance it was the queen. Odds are it was the queen. I don't know. <laughs> All right, well, that didn't really go as planned. I wanted to find the queen and put her in a resource hive, split the hive, have a resource hive and then a split hive out of it and let them make their own queen. But the whole purpose of that was to prevent a swarm. And if when I was moving that queen yesterday, if I messed up and she did fall off and got lost, I may have prevented a swarm inadvertently. So. That's where we are. I'm gonna just leave them and hopefully this thing will fix itself and the bees will get a new queen in there and they'll just be a big monster hive. So that's what's going on. And uh, yeah, I guess lessons learned. I learned when moving a queen to be super cautious and get her right over the box where you're putting her and make sure you got a hold of her when you, when you reach for her. Uh, yeah. Just lots of things, lots of things to learn still. That's the way it is. Talk to you later. <laughs>